Hi you guys, I wanted to make a quick little update before it was like too late. Um, I have my little boy here, he's, you can kind of see him. He's swaddled up in the back sleeping. Um, but he is already 10 weeks old and it has taken me 10 weeks <laughs> to get my ducks in a row together to be able to make a video. Um, but I have started my ideal protein journey again. Thank you Swayze. Um, and so I wanted to kind of do an update about it. I know there's a lot of you that are following that are, um, doing the ideal protein, um, and follow those videos. So I did want to start this again, um, because I know one, there's a lot of people who do the whole program. They lose the weight they want to lose. Um, and then sometimes you fall off the bandwagon a little bit. You eat things you shouldn't, you don't keep up how you should, you don't follow the maintenance program, and that happens. It's life and it's okay. It is totally okay to start over. Um, it's not something that you're gonna start and stop and absolutely no questions asked ever have to try again. There's probably nothing in life like that. Um, is, is it possible to never have to do it again? Totally. Um, in my situation, I was, um, I was, I got pregnant again, which was totally my plan, but um, I gain a lot of weight when I'm pregnant. That's just what it is. So, um, I have been doing Ideal Protein for six weeks now, six weeks, and um, I have lost, let me think about this, I should have wrote this down, I have lost 26 pounds in six weeks. So. That is where I'm at now, and I would like to lose another, I think, 50. Excuse me. <laughs> um, I think I'd like to lose another 50 pounds. Um, so that is where I'm at right now. We are going, it is um, almost the end of July, middle of July right now. I would like to be done by November. We are planning on going um, to Mexico for a family vacation in November and I would like to be done for that. Um, and if I don't get to an exact number, I'm kind of okay with it. I know when I get down to like around my goal, I'm pretty happy with my body and more confident and everything. So I'm not like dead set on a number. And I know that even after I start phasing off, I'm going to lose a little bit more anyway. So um, right now, I also wanted to update anybody who's doing Ideal Protein right now what my go-tos are. Okay, so some of my go-tos this round, they have changed a little bit. Um, I guess we'll start with this. This is the vanilla um, pre-made drink, and these are a little bit more expensive to buy, but you do what you gotta do. <laughs> um, okay, so I do these with um, coffee in the mornings for breakfast, or I'll do them in the afternoon sometimes if I need a little like pick me up. But um, I can also take these to our local um, barista downtown and she will mix up a um, coffee drink and it is so good. But I did buy, um, for Father's Day, I bought my husband an espresso machine <laughs> and I get a lot of use out of it. It wasn't planned that way. Um, so I'll do the um, espresso shots and then I'll do this in it over Mommy. ice and it is like Mommy. Yeah, what's up? You got one too. Cutter buddy milk. Cutter buddy milk. That's Cutler's milk. This is Cutler by the way. Um, so I'll do this with espresso and it is just like to die for. Um, and that is unrestricted. Um, my restricted fave is the chocolatey coconut bars. Um, I like these and I also like the peanut butter caramel bars, something like that. I don't have any more in my um, pantry. So these were the ones that I really also like too. I like the strawberry wafers or the lemon or the orange. Any of the wafers are super good. Um, and then these have saved my life. Hold on, Swayze's. Yeah. You have a big cough and a big sneeze. Oh my goodness. These are amazing and they're really good if you put them in the freezer or the fridge too. But it's just, it's a raspberry um, chocolate bar and they're kind of in like um, little like pre-cut squares. And I can do like 
one or two little like pieces a day so when i go in weekly to weigh in and buy food i'll buy two of these and that'll get me through the entire week and um, my ideal protein coach said you know if i eat one or two little squares a day you don't have to count it but it like curbs all issues that i'm having so totally love this this has saved me so many times um and i'm trying to think what other foods that i really really like i have gotten by with um salsa um you can make your own salsa and instead of using chips if you don't want to use a packet of your chips you can use um like pickle slices um like the pickles that you would put on like a hamburger um those have been so good and it kind of sounds gross at first i was like no way it is really good so um those are kind of the things that have been holding me over this far it's been really easy um summertime here and so it's really easy to get your meat and veggies in the only hard part is us you know during summertime there's lots of like yummy fruits you don't gotta have and desserts obviously that you've got to avoid but other than that um i feel like it's been going really well um and this is just something really easy that i know that i can do easy not easy it's not that easy but it's easy so um i will try to do more updates on this if you guys have questions leave them down below um i'm going to try and be a little bit better about getting back to everybody on them so if you have questions leave them down below but if not we'll we'll see you in the next video Bye.